Hello, my friends. It's episode 34. <clears throat> I forgot to move this. I feel like I could actually bring the Italian planes home. that they kind of suck. No, uh, actually on the grounds that, uh... Well, I do need to defend it, Lee. This was supposed to be over here. In case the Greeks join the Allies. Okay, all right, let's go. shuffling going on. Perhaps another opportunity to get some free kills. Now some repairing. Okay, looks like the AI is thinking about something. for that.
interceptors! Oh, minus four. Yikes. That tank anti air technology is definitely, uh. <laughs> is definitely the stuff of legend. Ooh. throw Okay. Well, the old mechanized is back. Okay, once again, no real damage from the enemy. It does make you wonder, uh... How much abuse they can take. probably start kicking off research now. I've not actually taken a lot of damage. So this can't reach London from here, but I've got long range now, so I can just upgrade it. Do I really want to hurt you? Yes. Oh, I lowballed again. 
I better stop getting these low balls or I'm not going to kill it. Oh, I low balled again. Hey, I high balled. American carrier. Do you have a strike? No, fused you. Oh, long range aircraft just can't quite get there. So I take half damage. Beautiful. Come! These are hostile waters. <laughs> Apart from the fighter damage, they did not get much out of me. It's a low ball. Load and he hide, great. Just what the doctor did. RNG here. And again. And again. One for one. It's not worth it. He needs to run this stuff, or I will just send my tank in and destroy it all. repair juice here.
my bolt, he's dead. Literally devouring these guys. It's not even an exchange. It is a slaughter. Let's uh, repair this sub first, because it's actually in more danger, since there's a ship here. I'll heal these guys back up and get them on the front line, but it's just a core, so it's nothing exciting. Send the AT gun up there. So. Distribute them a little bit more neatly. Just putting this here just in case, like, the AI goes on some kind of suicidal rampage trying to get this. This is going great. Turn after turn after turn I do untold damage to them. They get very little in return for it. I just finished upgrading my air force as well. I'm not going to use it this turn because obviously there's a cost. right now. Oh, I didn't leave enough money to transport that. very frustrating. Okay, this town now has zero supply value. 
I should be able to kill them next turn. It's just amazing how bad Italian units are in this war. It, they're, they're just, it's more of a burden. If they were neutral, it would be better for you. Because <laughs> then you wouldn't have to worry about protecting them. Yeah, it's going to be hard to break him. This is still level 1 weapons. I guess he's just struggled to get off the front line. Okay, this guy is starting to crack. That's good. This will make going after this guy even easier. Supply in this area is not good enough. I literally cannot do anything with this army because of the supply being so weak. this one. Do I want to add mobility as well? I certainly could. For the moment let's just go level 2 weapons. Prepare my uh, prepare for my assault on this dust. Wow, they just cleared out the back area. Was that wise? Oh, the zone of control here is broken. We can actually push up. This artillery can load up and we can go for the capital, potentially. The capital is now on life support. This guy has six entrenchment, but if I, uh, same with this, same with what I'm planning to do here, if I just wait for the artillery to load, go for a triple artillery shot sandwich and then just throw everything I've got at it, shoot with this twice, then shuffle, shoot with this, shoot with this, shoot with this, then shuffle, shoot with this. If I go in hammer and tongs, I should get the job done. Oh, look. But I already blocked it, so... Sucks to be you.
The loss of the capital would be huge. They're already, like, suffering morale-wise because of the sheer volume of losses. It's the same as the Russians. 83% and I haven't taken any of their territory yet. Just 17% purely on uh, just doing untold damage to them. I'm going to use this to shuffle this out so I can upgrade it to Mark II. Everyone's morale is terrible, apart from mine. Mine's still 98%. <laughs> Everyone else is suffering. <laughs> Japan's is, is actually uh, recovered. It was like as low as 86 after losing some some satellite stuff. You will regret coming here. You will be made to regret. tank has got two strikes but the situation for it is not good as currently the supply is bad all right I don't think there's anything else I want to do Continue to uh, smack the Russians around without really losing anything. The war for the sea is going very badly for my enemy. <laughs> as my submarines just make a mockery of the Allies. Um, it's still only 42. We could see a we could see China capitulate by 43. We could we could see China capitulate in December potentially. If my huge artillery strike on this is successful in dislodging this unit and I take this position there is a non-zero percentage chance that they surrender instead of uh, retreating back to a an alternative capital. I mean, don't get me wrong, odds on they'll retreat back to their alternative capital, but uh, either way the morale hit will uh, reduce the amount of resistance that they that they offer. I actually have a fair spare amount of MPP here. Just want to keep pushing that logistics up. Once it reaches level 5, it's quite useful. 
think all of my ships are pretty much ready to rumble. In the event of a... Uh... In the event of the US appearing. I've got upgrades to do here as well. That's a good point. Okay. Two turns until these are loaded. Two turns until I execute my plan to take these two positions. That could literally be the end. Alright. That is it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys next time.